We're seeing COVID positive patients every day. Altoona paramedics are required to wear PPE, but when asked if they have a good supply of it, I will tell you that we are at a level that I would describe as a little less than comfortable, uh, but as it currently stands, our call volume and our burn rate on our PPE, we're not in a depleted state. And they've had to adapt. Policy changes were made to ensure safety of patients and paramedics, including cleaning and sanitizing the ambulance. Now the Altoona Fire Department isn't the only fire station in the metro doing something about the high number of COVID cases. And here at the West Des Moines Safety Center, they're doing things a little bit differently than in Altoona to combat the high numbers of COVID-19. As cases rise, I'm concerned. Assistant Chief David Edgar says we have some intense cleaning that we do with UV lighting. So I put special glasses on to see the process. N95 is any patient contact with those eye protections with any patient contact gloves, any patient contact gowns if it's suspected COVID. Every patient is treated as if they have COVID-19. We're doing the best as we go along that we can with it. Lake and McGee, Local 5 News, we are Iowa.